flower is a specialized part of an angiospermous plant which helps in reproduction and development of seeds and fruits it can occur singly or in clusters parts of a typical flower and its functions the first part of the flower is pedicel a flower is attached to the shoot by a stalk called pedicel number 2 thalamus or receptacle the upper swollen part of the pedicel is called thalamus or receptacle which holds the major organs of a flower number 3 epicalyx it is a calyx or sepals like extra hole of floral appendages which protects the flower in the bud stage it may or may not present in all types of flowers it is green in color and helps in photosynthesis next is calyx the calyx is the outermost hole of a flower which is green in color it protects the flower in its bud stage prevents it from drying out and also helps in photosynthesis the calyx is also known as sepals corolla the word corolla comes from the latin word which means little crown it is the hole that surrounds the reproductive part of the flowers it is also known as petals mostly petals are brightly colored and has a sweet fragrance androecium the male part of the flower has two parts they are the anthers and the filaments the anther is responsible for the production of pollen the filament is the stalk that holds the anther and attaches it to the flower the androecium or the male part of the flower is also known as stamen gynoecium the female part of the flower has three parts they are the stigma the style and the ovary the stigma the upper or head part of the structure which receives pollen and begins the process of fertilization is called stigma the style this is the stalk portion of the structure which gives space to pollen tube to reach the ovary the ovary this is the base of the structure which holds the ovules awaiting for fertilization the gynoecium or the female part of the flower is also known as pistil inside the ovary the flower's eggs also known as ovules are located which after fertilization grows into a seed in a fruit plant